<laughs> it counts. I didn't put the vaccine in it, but I touched it. Here's the downside to this fucking thing. Now it makes us another batch of delicious purple Kool Aid, but it uh, replaces the lock pick as our item. Why? Because I guess we it's an item we need that, that you have to have. And so we can't like. There's no more lock pickable doors, but still. Have, have you lock picked a single door in this playthrough? I I don't remember. I opened do. a drawer in the police department that had flame grenades in it, I, as most police departments ha- randomly have. Well, I mean, police departments run by Brian Irons. There's only like two things you can open with lock picks in this game. It's what really is odd. the prompt for lock? Is it literally just do you want to lock pick this? Yes yeah. or no? And if you're Leon, you have to find little keys. He doesn't have a lock pick. He has a lighter. What does the lighter do? Uh, the shit that I've done with the lighter in Claire's game, like certain puzzles need it. Oh, and then I guess you probably could have used the lighter to light that plant that's on, like, the guy that fucking was throwing the gasoline and died? Yeah. Gay. <laughs> <laughs> I see. <laughs> All historians, please report to the museum downstairs. He's got like a fucking Jason mask face. He's uh, extra and thriller because he's so ready. <laughs> You gotta take out William Birkin's son. Bitch! This is when the selfish art will decide to have a time limit because we're in the boss room. Oh, sure. Like, I just think there's a there's an actual employee watching the security <laughs> camera. It's like, okay, finally, she's there. We yeah. can get the five minutes. I'm done telling historians to go downstairs. Yeah. All the goddamn historians are out of here. Oscar Pistorius. What do you think the chances are this elevator will arrive before I kill the boss? Mm, my guess is zero. Yeah, it's like one percent. It's a good guess. Even though you can see the rate it's arriving at. Hey, William Birkin, you crazy son of a bitch, four on door, I look motherfucker. <laughs> He'll never make it to me. He'll never. Never. Go. Wow. All right. <laughs> oh, uh, spoilers! He turns into a giant dog monster. Now. That eye is freaking me the fuck out. There was an action figure of this version of Birkin, and it was kind of like a Transformer in that you could turn him into this dog version as well. That's pretty cool. It is. I lost, uh, but I used to have a uh, Hunk action figure, which was completely game inaccurate because he had the uh, custom, like, shotgun with the full stock and a revolver. (laughs) Uh, which he never has access to those things. We have to be careful because he has an attack that is dubbed the bite and chew, uh-huh. and it can fuck you up. Is like, it royally? Does he like grab you and shake you? Yeah. And if you're in anything other than like completely fine, it can fucking kill you. Bitch ass bitch. No, don't bite chew. William Birkin, I didn't mean nothing by it. <laughs> that's I think he was just doing the animation. Yeah, that's oh god, there it is. Shit. Shit, I have to get Claire up and eat her. Eat the herbs. Get that herb. Woo! So many herbs. I'm so dank, you can't stop me. Fuck <laughs> oh, shit. Legalize red herb. <laughs> Don't let the government control your healing with first aid spray. <laughs> Obama. Oh, Obama. Fuck, I'm going to eat the other one. I'm fine. You're fine. I'm going to test something. I'm going to shoot him with my last two Colt bullets and see if he kills him. So you kill him? Come at me, motherfucker. Frontier justice. <laughs> I'm going to black, black you like one of them oh, engines. Shit. Black. Yes! <laughs> and I got one bullet left in case Leon gets up at it when I need it. I I mean, I that was a complete guess yeah. that that bullet was going to kill him, but goddamn wasn't it amazing. That is incredible. It would have been better if it was the last one, but that's still fucking great. So, uh, that's why they call me Revolver. Did they spell elevator wrong on the floor? Elevator? Is it supposed to be... Uh, T-O-R, yeah. That's how I say it. It's like, so I'm getting the elevator. Elevator... This is a really good low screen. That is. <laughs> That's fucking better than most indie games that come out now. <laughs> Just that. I want an indie game elevator. <laughs> Action? With a question mark because I don't know if we're going to get sued. Yeah. I got what makes you run down that hallway. All right. Yeah, that's it. Let's enjoy our ending cutscene. Leon almost gets his head knocked off by a wall right here. Sure. Hurry. What happened to him? Son, I guess maybe we'll find out. Next time. <laughs> it's so slow moving. She's like, I guess I could just jump on it. Yeah. Guess I could go down through the entryway. Shit. What my favorite, one of my favorite Leon quotes is coming up if you got your headphone on. I do. Is it's just when he yells, it worked. <laughs> he sounds so inf- 
uh, thrilled? Enthralled? Enthralled? Is that a word? Happy? <laughs> Not now, Leon. Sherry's unconscious. Is she? I, I could have fucking told you that. I wonder how she gave it to her. It's just a thing in a tube. Like, she pour it down her throat? Yeah. She just rub it on her? Get ready for it. The be one of the best Leon quotes ever. <laughs> With bated breath. Where? Where am I? It worked! <laughs> Claire's like, she just cuts to them and she's just staring at him. I like how it doesn't even show him during the line. That's incredible. Ugh. <sighs> I noticed Claire, it must be a Redfield family thing. She has that knife in a holster on her chest, just like Chris does in his games. And yet, she never fucking uses it. Well, I mean, she started with it. I cut Brad Vickers with it. I feel like uh, in the cutscene, uh, the last cutscene with her mom, uh, it wasn't in the holster. Yeah, it, it doesn't show up on her model, I don't think. Weird. I don't know if this version looks like she skipped the credits music or not. So the A series of credits is this really dramatic piano music. Yeah. So wait till you hear the B mode credits. Yeah, we can't skip them. We're gonna sit here for a couple minutes. So how you been? <laughs> I'm doing all right. I'm Graphic. Doing, doing better than Motiji Fujita or June Agawa. He's probably dead. He's good people. There's two Junes. I ain't no, no Americans working on this game. <laughs> Yoshiaki, Ryoji, Shimogam, Moneyuki. That all right? There's a all right. There's a lot going on. Too many damn syllables, like Katsutoshi Karatsuma. So many K's. Sound. Good job, you guys. Ain't nary a L in any of these names. <laughs> the CG movie crew and Magica Impression. They're like, this is why the Magica. A Magica drive like this. <laughs> Oh, uh, we didn't make a single put it on a boat and sink it in the ocean joke this entire playthrough. Well, I mean, we're not done. That's true. <laughs> Take got, all the motion actors. <laughs> we're only halfway there. Whoa, whoa, living on a prayer. Whoa, Apparently Microsoft uh, helped. With special thanks. <laughs> yeah. But well, here's some uh, English sound. Call the dad. I wonder if any of those people are still alive. No. There was a second engineer in case of Bruce Fleming died. <laughs> Ian Rodness was biding his time waiting. English script. Wow, that's not very many people to do the fucking English. Yeah. There's, there's like eight lines in this whole game. Akira worked on it. Tetsuo Kaneda. Did you see how Akira predicted the future? No. Because Akira, a famous anime movie, came out in like the 80s. Yeah. Uh, it It's set in 2020, and the finale is at the uh, Tokyo Olympic Stadium. And of course, 2020 Olympics are going to be in Tokyo. Oh, are they? I hadn't heard that. Shinji Mikami. Good old KG Inafune. I, Wait, who is that? He's the guy. I don't. I can't see his title. It already scrolled off screen. I'm sorry. My score is going to be so bad. I mean, am I literally just being racist? Isn't there an uh, Inafune guy who does something else? Like uh, uh, Inafune? Game Grumps? Not Game no, Grumps. He's no, the... Grump. Okay, what's it called? Goof Troop. <laughs> yeah. Something like that. Let's see what my score is. Also, the score screen art that comes up here doesn't really look like Claire and Sherry. It's very stylized. And also, they're tearing up the streets on their hog, yo. That looks nothing like them. <laughs> Sweet ride, though. Oh, only an A. Oh. Also, I saved my game uh, before we resumed when fucking I got back up to where we were playing. I'm so ashamed. Fucking plebeian. I'm so bad at this fucking game. You can get an S in the Japanese version, but not this one. Um, you wait, can, can you really... This. What's the highest rank you can get? A in the American version. Oh. I unlocked the infinite rocket launcher. Sweet. I like that the rocket launcher in this game is like a stinger. And yeah. You can still shoot zombies with it somehow. Fucking lock onto their face. Mm-hmm. We have 34 seconds to fill with banter. Clever banter. <laughs> well, we'll have just enough time to start Leon's game. Oh, we doing both? We, we're, nice. doing, we're doing everything, son. Keep up. Fuck! I ain't cheating the people out of their Resident Evil 2, son. <laughs> they pay for it. Resident Evil 2. I do love that, that voice. It's great. They stopped like doing that in modern ones, I think. Because I bet they everything. did. Yeah. 
Exactly. Because they might as well not be fucking Resident Evil, so why even call it that in the fucking title sequence? I have to go into options menu, because it's the GameCube version, and switch it to Leon's story. What in the actual fuck? 